Hello folks, I hope you're well, I really, really do. Now, this is an extra one, this is the first one you're going to see off me today. You shouldn't be getting this one, this is a bonus. It's only chatting, it's just letting you know what's coming up, to be honest with you. I've recorded today's um, videos, there's only five or six, it's pretty quiet on the Western Front. But it shouldn't have been. Pal of mine has let me down, who was supposed to be doing the live Q&A today, well not live, but the old Q&A or... Or whatever else. We did part one last week with Peter Van Lingham. This was going to... Well, not part one. Number one. This was going to be number two. He's let me down. And I can't get hold of him. I messaged him late last night. He didn't come back to me. I've rung him twice today. Not heard a thing. It's not like him. He's normally on the ball. Anyway, we'll pursue that. No doubt over the next 24 hours, I'll find out what's going on. He may have had some health issues. Something could have gone amiss. And these things happen in life. So, no worries there. Anyway, to that end... I recorded today's first five or six videos. I'm going to let you know in a minute what they are. This is a bonus, as I say. And then, what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to carry on with me. Things were better in my day videos. The things that really essential on the 70s and when I grew up. Um, but really, they catch you in the back end of the 60s and probably 81, 82. And that's it. That's the cutoff. And I'm saying, when I were a kid, when I were a lad... Things were better than they are for the kids of today. And also, for my kids, 20, 25 years ago now, they were better when I was a kid. I've no doubt about that. And I'm going to tell you why. We've done two in the series already. We've got, I think, three more to go. I'll let you know what they are in a minute. But let's tell you what's coming up today. Sorry for the bins. I'm going to get that glare off that light. Nothing I can do. I need to read. I need to read. I do apologise. Right. I've done some videos. What are you going to get today? The first one comes out about half past six. This should be about quarter past six. If I get it time right, quarter past six, this will be out. Let you know what's on for today. But half past six, I've got a tactics video to Eric Tenag. It won't interest many of you, but it might interest some. I've got a tactic. I've mentioned it before, but I'm, I'm doubling down on it. I'm telling him where he's going wrong because he's making one massive, massive, massive mistake. And I'm trying to put him right. He probably won't listen. I know we won't hear it, but assuming he does, I'm trying to put him right. Then after that one, we're doing the wrap-up of the game yesterday. The Aston Villa versus Manchester United game. I normally do a video before the game. Half-time. And a finishing video. I did the before the game. I left the half time and I left the finishing video. I thought I'd have a good think about it and do something today. I've done it. It's on at about quarter to seven. Seven o'clock we've got one on about Colleen Nolan. If you're going to watch only one video today, folks, I would suggest this is the one you watch. It's longer than most of them. It's about ten minutes long. But that's not too long, is it? That's not too long. It It's about three minutes and I explain what I'm going to do first and how I'm going to go about things. Because I bring two other well-known people into the mix before we get on to Colleen herself. Then three or four minutes in, we get on to Colleen. If you're going to listen to it, listen to it all. You'd be wasting it if you only get out of it after two or three minutes. Listen to it all and tell me what you think. I want your opinions. They're important to me. I want your opinions. That's the ten minute. Then after that, we're going to go on to the Super Bowl and some thoughts there. Not that I'm a Super Bowl. I'm not an American football watcher. But it's about old Taylor again into it and the old bow, her bow there. And then we're going on to plus size people. That's the other video I'd watch. There. I would imagine Colleen Nolan and plus size people. I'm not trying to make any, um, you know, in between the two of them. Although she's pulling a bit of timber again, Colleen. Plus size people is worth probably looking out for. It's something I've seen on the TV today. And then finally, we're, we're having a little bit of a chat about Keir Starmer. And that would have been it. As well as the, the Q&A they have done with his pal of mine. But as I say, he's let me down. So... What we're going to do after that, and now I've not done them yet, I'm going to do them in a minute. I'm going to try and record another one in the series. Why were all things better? Uh, why all things were better in my day? See, I'm reading it because I can't remember it and I've made the title myself. Why all things were better in my day? Now, what we're going to do, we're going to start with with some series that we used to watch on the Beeb. Well, not the Beeb, but when we were younger. There's never do with the Beeb, not why I said the Beeb. We're going to watch some series that we used to watch. Some comedies, some talent shows and that kind of stuff. Then we're going to go into a British drama series, British drama series. Then we're going to go into music programmes. And then we're going to go into, well, we did have something after that, sports programmes. And that's going to end video number one. So that's going to be the first one. That's definitely going to be out tonight. That's going to get done because that's not going to be that long. I'm not going to stand too long. Half an hour maximum, folks, I promise you. Then video number two is going to be that kid stuff. All stuff we watched or I watched as kids. As a kid, as kids, as a kid, mainly British, but with a bit of a, a bit of a US feel thrown in. So we're going to do kid stuff, and then the one that's going to be the last one of the lot is it the last one? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Then we're going to go into American drama series, American dramas. 
And last but not least, and the best of the lot, is British comedy. Now, there's a lot on there, folks, a lot on there. American comedy, I've got hardly any of it. I watch bits, but only bits. A lot of the series I know were really, really good in the 70s and 80s, but I never really got into many American series. On the other hand, British, I watched everything. I've got loads. And I want to know from you folks what you liked and what you didn't like and what I've missed out. What I've missed out. You don't have to tell me today, wait until I've done the videos. So, the first one will be up today, the other two or three. Might be a second up today, I don't know. But if not, they'll be up over the next two to three days. So, within by Wednesday, stroke Thursday at the very latest, the series will be over. I'll have covered everything. And then you can tell me where I've gone wrong. And no doubt, some of you will. And I can handle that, don't you worry at all. So, that's the itinerary for today. And a couple of pointers to later this week. Okay? Hope you're all well.